Hi, I'm at the Stormbird here in Camberwell, which is a new specialty beer pub, which I'm really excited about because we didn't have one in Camberwell and this is my hood. So I've got a couple of beers today to have with some posh pork scratchings. First beer that I have is this Hunter's Half Boar and it's made in Newton Abbott in Devon by Paul and Aileen. Now I first found Hunter's beers through the Sainsbury's Great British Beer Challenge and they had their full bore entered into the competition. Sadly, the full bore didn't win, but I met Paul on the day of the tasting. He gave me eight of his beers, and I really like their half bore, which is this session ale. Also, I've got is this rather swish looking bottle here. Now this is made by Estrella Dam, which is a big brewery in Spain, but this is a special beer that they made called In It which I know sounds a little bit more like street slang for isn't it. In it in Spanish means never done before. Now this beer is a classed as a wheat beer or a white beer. Now what makes this beer even more special was it was made in collaboration with Ferran Adria, who is the head chef at El Bulli in Spain. And so this beer was crafted with his help and the help of his sommeliers at El Bulli to produce a beer that was made for food. Going with these beers, I've got Mr. Trotter's Great British Pork Crackling. They're not even called scratchings. And as you get a close-up of that bad boy right there, that is a pretty mean looking bit of crackling. Mm. It's not really over salted, which you find so much with scratchings. British made pork as well, as you can see, there's a happy um, Union Jack sporting pig there on the front. Hunter's half boar first. Really impressed with this half bore. Really tasty, really fresh. Nice, hoppy, warm aroma on there. A little bit, little bit nutty. I love that beer. Ideal session ale. You could sit down and drown a couple of those really easy. Not that I'm suggesting that you do that. Let's try and see how this white beer, Estrella Dam, in it goes. Now they suggest that you serve it in wine glasses, it's been infused with coriander, with orange peel. You're getting all that lovely, sort of intricate flavor. Let's see how it stands up to some of this crackling. I think you might be split into two camps. Because you're getting more of the aromas of the citrus and those spices, that coriander coming through, There's, it's lifted, it's a bit more fresh, it cleans it away. Whereas this half bore, it seems to sort of, they fit together a little better. Both really, really good though. And being Canadian, I hate picking a favorite. So I won't. Where can you get this stuff? This Hunter's Half Boar is about $1.99 a bottle and is available direct from the brewery and also from Tucker's Maltings online. Most people are buying their beer online these days. This Estrella Dam in it isn't widely available to buy in stores. It's actually just available at the John Lewis Food Hall here in London. But it's available online through Waitrose. It's also available through Beers of Europe and Highbury Vintners at about five, six quid a bottle. Well worth it though, when you think you got a great big 750 mil bottle like that. Mr. Trotter's Great British Pork Crackling are available at Harvey Nichols and Selfridges and in, I think Booth's up north. Um, about 189 a pack, which I know is pricey, but I th think they're quite happy pigs. And, you know, they're proper British, so. Big thanks to Moira and their team here at the Stormbird. If you are in Camberwell, do come check it out. It's a great, great pub. Right, we'll see you soon. Bye.